Hi Dress Up Cuties! Today we're going to draw a polar bear inspired by Starbucks. So let's get started. To draw this cute little polar bear, we're going to first start by drawing its head. So I'm going to come right at the top right here and draw a curve at the top of our polar bear's head. And then I'm going to come around here and widen it and round it off. So same thing on this side. And so about right here, it's going to be a sh kind of short because there's a scarf wrapped around his uh, neck. So about right here, I'll just bring it in. Because it's really cold outside. <laughs> okay, so about right there, now that I'm pretty even, I'm going to connect it with a curve. So this is going to be the beginning of his scarf. So the scarf is covering part of his head. So it's basically like a little dome. And then from there, we're going to come down right here. And we're just going to draw his scarf. So right underneath. Let's give him a nice thick scarf. And then once again, go ahead and connect it. Okay, so then let's come back up here and finish our polar bear's head first. Round this part off. We're going to come up right here and just draw his ears. So that way it doesn't look too weird, right? <laughs> and same thing over here. Just drag some points across. There. Now we can come in here and bring him to life. So towards the bottom right here, I'm going to basically start to draw an oval that comes maybe to the center of this uh, dome. So about right here, I'll start close to the scarf. And I'll just draw a big dome right, not a big dome, I mean a big, uh, kind of like an oval -ish shape. There. And then we're going to come right in the center here and draw a big polar bear nose. So just a curve right in the center. And we're going to connect it to about the right here. Her big polar bear nose. And I'm going to come in here with a highlight, so a little oval, and just shade this all in black. There. <laughs> and then let's come down to the center, bring a straight line down, and we're going to curve it up for Cute little smile on both sides. There, now let's draw his eyes. I'm gonna come right about, say right here. I'm just gonna draw a simple curve. So our polar bear is really, really happy. And same thing on this side. So about right there. You go in and thicken your curve. And then I'm just going to come right on top of the eye and very lightly just draw two little curve lines. It's very slight. And then when you're coloring it, add two little round cheeks right here. Okay, so then now let's come back here and we're going to draw, um, finish off his scarf. Come to this point right here and we're just going to draw a curve that comes out. And about right here, another curve that basically just follows it and connect it. And then come in here and we're just going to draw some lines for the tassel parts that come out of our scarf. And you can come in here and add some um, curves to our scarf. And down here. So notice as I'm coming to this side, the curves are going this way. And on this side, the curves are going the opposite way. It just helps to have make the scarf look a little bit more um, round. Okay, so then from there, let's start to draw the bear's arm. So I'm going to come right here, once again, where the scarf is. And I'm just going to draw a curve. And so let's work on the first arm. So it's basically all going to come to the center. So just 
remember where your center is. So about right here, I'm gonna curve this arm about right here. Curve it out and bring it back in. So I'm remembering where my center is. I won't go past that because I need to put a cup of hot cocoa in there. Ah! <laughs> I'm so I was too lazy. I should have moved my body so my arm is in the right position. <laughs> okay, there. And then we're going to do the same thing on this side. So about right here, I'll start. So the same thing. Imagine the arms coming around about right here. So I'm just going to make sure both arms are going towards the center. There. And then curve it back. Up. And then come in here and just draw two very slight lines. And then let's come over here. We're going to make it nice and fat. <laughs> so about right there, we're going to draw his body. And okay, about right there, I'm going to start to draw a big oval for his foot. So it's going to be a slight angle, this oval just to make it extra cute. So it's just a big old oval for his foot. So same thing on this side. So right here. So this drawing was inspired by Starbucks because I visit starbucks.com a lot <laughs> to check my points and rewards, you know, things like that. <laughs> and I saw this, um, a polar bear drawing of theirs for this winter and I was really inspired to draw it for you. So right in the center right here. And add a little curve and then we're going to come in here and draw the pads of our foot. This bear looks nothing like the Starbucks one but it was definitely inspired by the Starbucks bear. circles. There. Okay, so then now let's uh, give our bear a cup of hot cocoa. So um, we're going to come right in between his paws. I'm going to start with slight angle line on both sides. Then I'm going to connect it with a straight line. And we're going to draw our cap. So we're just going to come up slightly. And then give it a little step on both sides and then another step and connect it. And then come up. Uh, well, let's finish our cup first. So we're going to continue this angle all the way down. Right there. Let's give him a venti <laughs> and connect it. And then let's come in the center right here and draw a circle for our logo. Because it's so small, I'm just going to leave it as a circle and you can just color it in green. But I'm definitely going to add a little heart right here. And then let's add some uh, steam coming out of this cup of hot cocoa. All the way up. There. Um, okay, so then now we're pretty much done with our polar bear and his cup of hot cocoa. I'm going to come around and decorate him. Um, give him a scenery. So I'm going to come about right here. Just add some snow that he's sitting on. Okay, and then um, just like the Starbucks drawing, I'm going to add a big old candy cane right, say about right here. So right next to our bear, just stick out a big candy cane. Oops. This Sharpie is sticking to my paper today. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, so then from there, let's give some stripes to our candy cane. So I'm just going to come over here and here and there. Add 
some stripes. And then we're gonna add some trees right here for Christmas. So very simplified, just basically a triangle. and draw a circle and we're going to draw this other kind of uh, tree from Starbucks so just draw a line curve it out bring it back in so everything comes back to the center and I'm just going to quickly go ahead and finish this tree And maybe one more right here. So now to add some snowflakes and snow at the top. So I'm going to come in here with some circles here and there. and add some snowflakes. So I'm gonna draw a simplified snowflake at a different angles. So it's basically kind of like a star, but they're rectangular stars, <laughs> like a little sunburst. So I'm just gonna draw maybe three of them. And let's see here, maybe one over here at this angle. So there, I hope this drawing really inspires you to draw something warm and cozy for this holiday. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please give me a thumbs up and share it and remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.